I have a fun little morning planned for me in Winston. I found this cute little dog friendly coffee shop by me that I want to go to to do some like training on his settling in public. I want to make sure he is worn out first though. So we're at the park right now. We're going to play with his chocolate for a little while. Nor, why did I do this? Ready? Good boy. Leave it. Good boy. I'm worried about you. Do you need a second? You good? Good boy. I have been sick for literally the last eight days. Today is the first time I've woken up without like congestion or coughing. But the one like lingering symptom is that I have no freaking energy, like zero. Taking him here and then to that coffee shop is going to literally take me out for the day. This is the sacrifice I must make right now. I just got to the coffee shop and I had to do like a double take on Yelp because it says it's dog friendly and there's like photos of dogs there, but like it just doesn't look like a dog friendly place. I'm always scared to go somewhere that says it's dog friendly because I don't want to be that person just thinking I can like take my dog anywhere. Ugh, I'm nervous. I'm not nervous for him. I just like, I'm nervous of people judging me. There for like 20 minutes he did really good he didn't break command once he was just hanging out he's definitely not at a place where he's like relaxed and settled but he will hold his place command so we're making progress if you're in orange county there's like four or five different stereoscope locations and they're all dog friendly i have more energy right now than i have in an entire week so i dropped winston off at home and i'm gonna go wash i'm gonna wash my car but vacuum out my car wait until you see the state of my car i'm truly ashamed oh my I'm back home. I ate breakfast. I am currently sitting on this chair because Winston will not stop eating it and I'm actively trying to train him to not eat it with multiple different methods. I definitely did too much again. I'm freaking wiped and now I'm gonna have to recover on the couch all day. Don't even think I'm actively sick still. Like there's absolutely no way eight days later I'm actively sick. It's just like this lingering symptom of like no energy. It's the most frustrating thing in the world and my body needs to pull it together because we leave for camping in four days. Four. And there's a lot of preparation that comes with that.